Hello, this is Zeming from the University of Toronto. In this video, I'm going to introduce a project called Facial Expression Recognition using convolutional neural networks. Recently, the neural network becomes a hot topic, and it has been proven its advantages in recognizing high-dimensional objects like facial expressions. The project aims to recognize neutral faces and uh, six basic emotions. The task of the whole neural network is to reduce dimensionality from 48 by 48 to 7. I create an uh, application in C++. I use OpenCV library for basic image processing and face detection. I use Qt5 library for creating a graphical user interface. TinyDNA library is used for constructing and training convolutional neural networks. I use images from the CK Plus dataset for training the convolutional neural network models. For achieving a better performance, I modify the dataset for seven emotions recognition to achieve a balance of the amount of images over seven emotion classes. Human face is detected from each input image, and uh, the region of interest is cropped. The image is converted to 48 by 48 grayscale image. The values of all pixels are zero-centered and normalized. This is the architecture of the whole convolutional neural network. There are nine layers in total, which includes three convolutional polling layers and three fully connected layers. This architecture has a better performance on the validation dataset than other architectures. These are hyperparameters determined by the performance on the validation dataset. The first contribution is I modify the CK plus dataset for seven facial expression recognition. The convolutional neural network model trained on this new dataset achieved a satisfactory accuracy on the original test dataset. The confusion map for the result is shown on the right. In addition to that, a C++ application with a graphical user data interface recognize facial expressions in real time. The application runs on Windows system. Next, I'm going to do a demo for the application. If you want to know more about the project, you can visit the link below. I have uploaded all the materials on the website of uh, Multimedia Lab. This is a Windows application I created for this project. You can see the GUI of the application. So firstly, we need to load a convolutional neural network model. Then we can start. You can see my face is captured by a webcam in real time. So the input is a sequence of images. And uh, you can see some numbers below. Each number is a probability of one of seven emotion class. So you can see the number is changing, and uh, which means the uh, probability of each class is changing. So right now, uh, the neutral class has the uh, highest score, so which means the uh, label predict predicted is neutral. So I can make different emotions and uh, to try how convolutional neural networks recognize different emotions. Firstly, we can try happy. So please uh, see the score pointed by the cursor. You can see the score get higher as I make a happy face. So which means the probability of happy emotion get higher. I try surprise. So you can see surprise get a higher probability 
to be predicted by this application. So this is basically how this application recognizes different emotions in real time. Thanks for watching.